Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're returning, then thank you so, so much. You know it means the world to me because there's no point me doing this if you're not here with me enjoying the content. And uh, as I've said before, if you want me to do anything in particular, then please uh, comment as what you'd like me to do. So the last one I just did was... Um, the Marks and Spencer trousers and the wool sweaters from Uniqlo. And um, as I've said to you before, I've been blown away by the amount of approaches that I've, have, I've had from companies asking me to um, look at the brand, you know, receive items from the brand and generally um, review the brand. And I have had all sorts of things. I have had more than one for hair extensions don't need i have had one for um did i tell you about the one for uh psychic readings i've had um eyebrow stamps i don't know how they work they didn't really come back to me i've had the dodgy one with the ipl machine i've had um spectacles which there was nothing i liked and as i say always i won't do it for, with, without having faith in the product or or real interest in what the product might be myself, you know, would I be interested to see that? So I had an approach from a men's underwear company, and I'll be honest with you, I thought they've got they've got the wrong person, you know, they've made a mistake. I know I've got a deep voice, but um, I don't wear men's underwear, so. Anyhow, I went back to them and I said, um, I'm like a, a woman doing like stuff for women. And they quite quite rightly pointed out that um, most men's underwear is bought by women. And that's true. I can't remember the last time Rob bought his own underwear and I always buy my son-in-law's underwear and my son underwear and stuff like that. So it's... Uh, it's true. And with Christmas coming up, I thought this was really interesting. Now, I'm going to try. I won't do this with a straight face. That's the truth. But this is has been extraordinary. I mean, I'm 65 years old. I've got a husband that I've had for 44 years. I've got a son of 34. Yeah, I've got two son-in-laws, one of whom has no problem, like, changing on the boat in front of me. With his back to me, I hasten to that. So that'd be weird otherwise. Um, so, you know, I've seen a lot of men's pants in my time. Put it that way. I've washed a lot of men's pants. So when they talked about these pants, I was intrigued. Now, these pants are te technologically advanced. Designed advanced, I suppose. They're an advanced design. Go ahead and get your words out. So the clue is in the title. Separatech. Separatech. So they separate. So basically, they separate. This is ridiculous. I'm a grown up person. They separate the meat from the two veg. Is that the best way I put it? So I said to my son-in-laws, do you want to try them? And I said to Rob, do you want to try them? He was like, no, not really. But I said, I'll give them a go, Rob, you know, for goodness sake. So they were all highly sceptical. My son just said, no, no, not for me, not interested. And um, anyway, they arrived. And they're made from the most beautiful, soft bamboo, bamboo fabric. So they're really soft and kind of silky without being shiny or slippy and um these are the trunks um my son-in-law wanted trunks and my husband wears briefs like who knew that i'd ever be sharing this with you and it's a little bit of a shame because rob got the wrong side sent to his size sent to him and i do actually think it's quite important to get the right size so i would be sure to get the right size for your chaps and the packaging is really interesting because it's quite, you know, it kind of reminds me of an old, um, like, Windows computer game package. And um, 
it says free. I don't know what that is. That's like a little symbol there. You see that? It says free. And then it says stay in place, stay dry. Now, I've never thought about men's pants. It might surprise you to know that. But why these are revolutionary is because of this. There is a hole here. Now, when I showed the boys, you can't help but laugh, can you? And I really, <laughs> I really didn't know a better way of doing it because obviously the boys didn't want a module, so I've got a banana. <laughs> I'll get slung off YouTube. I've got no idea if I'm breaching anything here. But, I mean, this is just men's underpants. I did bras for women, so, like, what's the difference? I'm not holding anything rude. I'm just holding a banana. So, you've got the pants like this, and then you put your banana through the hole like this. <laughs> I shouldn't be laughing. I really, really didn't want to laugh. So, your banana has got its own compartment like this. I look like I'm doing a puppet show. So your banana is in its own pouch and your veg or your plums are in their own pouch just under here. So this means two things. This means that, that you, your banana and veg or plums or whatever you want to call them stay separate. So they don't get sticky, sweaty, blah, blah, blah. And this is, <laughs> sorry, this is the best bit really, because your banana's got its own little kind of cover. So your banana, like when you need to use your banana, in the bathroom you just need to unhood it so you don't have to pull your pants down i didn't realize that most men pull their pants down and put their banana over the top of their pants so this prevents that having to happen so you've got your own little compartment for your banana and your plums are separated and i can tell you now that my, my husband didn't get on with them because I think they were too big. So they didn't feel comfortable for him. He didn't feel supported. And I think if I, I probably will get him the medium when I order them for him because he's used to kind of, a, he wears a brief. And like, like, you know, let's not beat about the bush here. They kind of pouch everything up so they're kind of supported. And he didn't like the feeling that his banana was hanging free and I did laugh because he did look like Gonzo when he came out of the bathroom with his pants on. I think it's because they were too big. So my son-in-law loves them, loves, loves, loves them. Doesn't want to wear any other pants now. Every other pair of pants feels really uncomfortable. He could not have been more skeptical about these pants. He loves them. And I'm not lying to you. You know I will not lie to you. I will not promise. I will not lie to you. These are his pants. These are washed and dried, and he wants them back as soon as possible. And um, there we are. I cannot give them a more, um, what's the word? I can't give them a better endorsement. I will be buying these for both my son-in-laws and my husband for Christmas. And possibly my son, even though he is still sceptical, I think he just felt a bit embarrassed about talking about where to put his banana with his mum. But, um, and when I mentioned it, as you do, when I mentioned it to my delivery lady, who I talk to, because I see a lot of her, um, she said, oh, that's what my son wears. He only wears those pants that separate everything. And I think as well, <clears throat> on a very serious note, if you're having fertility problems, it keeps everything cool. And that's known to be a factor in fertility. So I will have a discount code and I will be sharing it in the description box. And I think they're about, they're, do, they're dollars, I think I saw them in. So they're about £30 for three or two pairs, which 
it's probably the same price as any high quality underpant and they've just got separatech on the side here and they come in kind of blues and greys and blacks and things but like i say my son-in-law well only one's actually tried them because the other one didn't get them in time for me to to make the video but if the first son-in-law is anything to go by i think the other one will love them too so great christmas great christmas gift for the men in your life separatech two pouch underwear i mean it's revolutionary really i mean i sound ridiculous i sound like i'm on qvc or something but it's not a thing that i had ever thought about and to be fair that's exactly what my son-in-law said he said well you just get your pants you put them on you don't think about it but actually wearing these has proven to him that there is a different kind of pant out there and that's all he wants now going forward so happy days who knew <laughs> thanks for watching bye